The president of the Philippines has a soft spot in his heart for kids at a Fresno school. Action News anchor Dale Urong explains how a class assignment led to the special connection. Good day. I would like to say hello to Mrs. Ricute and the students in Fresno Adventist Academy. Mrs. Terry Ricute and her students at Fresno Adventist Academy were shocked to hear that message from the president of the Philippines. Oh, what an honor. Uh, we were overwhelmed. The international shout out came courtesy of 11 year old Andre Esteban, who wrote a letter to President Duterte as part of his nationality assignment. He asked his mom to mail the letter. She put it on Facebook instead and asked people to see if they could help her, her make it reach the president. And as you know, social media makes the world a much smaller place. The following morning, I was shocked that like there were like 2,000 shares. I was like, what? What's going on? I was shocked. I was not thinking of that it might happen. But just two days later, Duterte's special assistant, Christopher Goh, posted the president's greeting. Especially to you, Andre Esteban. Andre, I receive your letter request, and I am most happy to oblige. I am sure that you will do great report. I was like, what? <laughs> Are you sure this is it? It was. Now Andre can get going on his report along with his classmates. We have to write um, like 100 lines okay. about the country, and I guess he's going to get his own whole entire page. <laughs> I guess he deserves that. Yeah. This is amazing. And I was, I, I says, you definitely went over the top. And I says, definitely extra credit, you know. Mrs. Ricuti urges her students to learn more about their heritage. The presidential message just made it more special. Continue being a good son and study well. I was surprised and I was happy that he actually responded. The class even taped a special message for Duterte. What was it? <laughs> they got it. Mabuhai, or welcome. Dale Yurong, ABC 30 Action News.